What is up guys, this is Heartless Gamer here with you to another GTA 5 video. Today I'm going to be showing you that the uh, poker money glitch uh, still currently works on August 1st, 2019. I know that there might have been a rumor out there that there was a patch, um, trying to fix some stuff. So uh, I'm just kind of showing you guys that it currently does work. Um, so basically, if you're not familiar with it and you're new here on my channel, uh, you do not see the video. Basically, what you do is you play any game of poker. Um, I'm just playing here in my penthouse, but uh, you can play any any card game this works for. Um, it could be roulette or poker, three card poker, regular poker. I prefer three card poker, but uh, this is I have blackjack here. So um, basically, what's gonna happen in this is I'm actually gonna end up losing. Um, usually, I win a lot, uh, but I lost here. I uh, pretty much like overthought it. Thinking I could win and hopefully get lucky, but I did not get lucky. Um, I did end up losing here. So instead of losing the 100k poker chips, I go here, go to my network settings. This also works for PC. Or I'm sorry, PS4. I'm not sure about PC, uh, so don't quote me on that. So basically, what you do is you go back online and then you go back into the game and you pretty much got to restart the whole entire game. Now, I do recommend doing this in invite-only session, um, only because for some reason, like when I do it regular online GTA, uh, it seems to like glitch out, where like it just tells me that I'm always not signed in uh, when I do online and play with other people. So I, I just kind of go to on online uh, invite-only session. So. That would be a uh, quick recommendation. So if you are having that issue, just just do the invite only session, uh, just so you don't feel like restart your console every time and stuff like that. Um, you know, that's another way you could do it is just dashboard your game as well. If that's quicker for you, go ahead. But then you got to remember you got to load back in. So uh, is it quicker? I don't think so. Uh, but you know, everybody has their own personal preference on it. That could also be a quick thing if you like aren't you're being too slow to grind or not. You could you could just dashboard. Um, that is an option as well. So just keep that in mind. There's there's definitely two ways to do it. I think this method is way more efficient when you just close your internet out and it just kicks you out of the session, back on the story mode, and then you load back up into a, uh, a multiplayer game. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much the reason why I did this, just, just to show that it, it is still currently working. Um, and because there was some concern that was not working. So you see here as I start to load in, you'll see that I still have my uh, poker chips. Um, I had 900, a little over 900k. Um, my wonderful penthouse. Um, and then I lost eight, went down to 800k and whatnot. Um, so yeah, so I have the 933,000 poker chips. Um, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Go ahead and drop a like, subscribe. That'd be really appreciated. Go drop in the comment section below. Definitely like to hear you guys' feedback on what videos else you should make. I do have a new video coming out later tomorrow or over the weekend of the, uh, where all the card locations are for the deck and the Red Dead Redemption part and the outfit. Uh, if you collect all the 54 cards, so that will be out later this week. But I guys want to thank you again for watching. I hope to see you guys next time. I am out of here. Bye.